JC Sports Kid has written a comment to one of my videos to inform me that I'm going to hell. Now what he wrote was, it's hard to read because you know how bad Christians are with punctuation. Okay, you are being kind of stupid. I get your point, but atheist, that does not make sense. Have a relationship with God and Jesus. You know that thing at no matter what you are still unhappy, well, if accept Jesus into your heart, then you will be filled. You will go to heaven and not to hell, which, W-I-T-C-H, you are on your way to currently. Think about what I said. Don't blow it off. Oh, I'm going to hell. And I wrote in response, J.C., no thanks. I want nothing to do with your imaginary God. As a young child, while a Christian, I always thought that Jesus was the lamest character in the Bible. Now I simply recognize that Jesus, of the New Testament, is pure evil. If I wanted a God, I would still reject the Christian version in favor of one that respects human virtue, like Apollo. P.S. Actually, I am happy. Odd that you are not able to recognize a happy person. This comment points out a problem when you start to say personal things about other people that you don't really know. Where he's talking about how I'm going to be going to hell and I should be really afraid of that. Because if he knew me, if he understood my background, he would know I've already been to hell. As a young engineer at Virginia Tech, one of my friends on my hall, Daryl, gave me a new perspective on this question about going to hell. Boys, we're just going to have to face facts. One day, we're going to be dead. And given our state of debauchery, we're surely going to hell. And when we get down there all scratch, we're going to have to give a tour. There'll be like a group of people all dead going to hell. And he'll be like, hi, I'm the devil. And he'll be like saying, hey, you're such and such person and you did these things and this is why you're here. And then when he gets to you, he's going to say, hey, Jim, let's see you right here. I see you went to Virginia Tech. Hell, boy, you don't need a tour. You've been here already. Keep on reading down. He's going to say, so were you an engineer? Well, forget about it. Hell, boy, you could get a tour. I'm going to take the day off. You just show these people around for me. So, a special message to all those Christians out there so concerned about my soul that I'm going to be going to hell. You know, to quote a great man, bugger off.